Welcome back! I believe this will be our first time taking on a Spear and Shield Knight, I think. And of course, they have a short attention span like everyone else. Darn it! Much easier when you're using a shield. Well, at least I got a bleed. Hey, 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 hey. One is bad enough, but two? Now you're pushing things. No. Goodness, he was a troublesome one, wasn't he? Come on. <laughs> and now... Oh yeah, I don't have the key. Okay. Okay, reloaded the profile, got the iron ring of keys off of the official that mysteriously disappeared. And in the process, I also encountered the Crystal Gecko again and got a pure Hardstone, I think. So that's three pure stones in this stage so far, which is... impressive. So, here we are. This is the area behind the, uh, Tower Knight's Archstone. There is a fat official. <laughs> oh dear. I'm wondering why I didn't make greater effort to dodge that as well. Bleed to death! <laughs> and a bloody iron key, which we will need for another NPC. For now, though, looting! And rescuing. <laughs> Who goes there? Uh, you killed that vile insect and saved me. <laughs> I am Colbio, the elder of the Twin Fangs of Boletaria. I thank you. You deserve a handsome reward. Only I have none. <laughs> Go on ahead. I shall sleep a while. Well, you can tell he's a military man. Sleeps anywhere, whenever he can. The armor he's wearing is brushwood set, which is horrendously impractical because it's heavy as all hell. And unfortunately, armor really drops off in usefulness as you go up in level. Oh well. Ooh, gecko! Shinies, shinies, shinies. That's fairly good, I suppose. And back here is a blocked off area that used to be the, behind the Dragling Merchant of 1 2. 
and... Wait, who just died and why? Regardless, this is too heavy for me. It's the tower shield. It is... Oh. Yeah, back to the first courtyard of 1-3. Um, the tower shield is... I think it may be one of the heaviest single pieces of equipment in the game. It's... Despite that, not worth it. It is ridiculously heavy. And its stats are only slightly better than, say, purple flame shield or steel shield, I think. And of course, it's ridiculously heavy. It has a weight of 30, I think. And bloody iron key can go up this tower. There's only one enemy back around here. But that enemy isn't generally much of a problem. Ring of the Accursed. It makes enemies attack you. And Ring of Magical Nature... And... I forgot. Which is horrible, I know. And that's how you get that lowered. Wearing the official's cap will make fat officials think that you're one of them. Somehow. Of course, they stop being fooled as soon as you attack them. They're not that stupid. Let's see, Ring of Magical Nature. Well, the process of elimination, so to speak, I believe it increases the maximum spell memorization slots. Which makes it fairly handy if you're a mage and have a ring slot to spare. What do you want with me? Have you brutes no mercy? Do as you wish. There are no secrets here. Only a tired, emaciated frame. NPCs apparently mistake you for an official as well. Do as you wish. There are no... But as soon as we take it off... Heavens, you... You... You came to... Save me. Thank you. No, I'm fine. With a little rest, I can soon walk. That's Yuria the Witch, by the way. You go on ahead. I do not wish to be a dead weight. They're not very bright, are they? You go on ahead. Just one little hat fools them. Anyway, we're done rescuing now. Later.